Hey, welcome to Man Kitchen Recipes. I am Kevin, and today I'm going to be cooking out on the Blackstone. Uh, it's a little cool. It's not freezing. It's a little breezy, but it's a lot better than the 27 it was the other day. So what I'm going to do today is something I'm creating, calling the Queso Crunchadilla. That's right, Queso Crunchadilla. It's probably what you think it is, so let me uh, just show you what the ingredients are. We'll go out and cook it, and we'll come back in and do a taste test. All right, for these Queso Crunchadillas, all I'm going to do is use some queso. This is actually quesadilla Mexican style melting cheese, flour tortillas, burrito size, and I found these uh, tahine tostadas made by Mission when I was going to get just regular um, tostada shells. But these are actually a little smaller and they're going to work perfect for this burrito size uh, tortilla for these queso crunchadillas. Okay, for these queso crunchadillas, just gonna put a couple of pats of butter down, a little bit of olive oil to keep that from burning. Get this heated up. I showed you I'm using the uh, tahine tostadas. I think that's just gonna add to a little flavor. Okay, so all you really wanna do is just get some cheese down let that start melting in and one of your tahine tostadas I'm gonna set that right there while this is all melting we'll let that go for a couple of minutes and since this is queso add a little more queso on top white cheese on top of that crunch portion of this uh, crunchadilla Okay, cheese is starting to melt a little bit, so what you want to do for your uh, wrap is just fold it up. Fold it up. Yeah, it's warm. Fold it up. Oh yeah, it's getting crunchy right there. Okay, get this folded over. <laughs> That there's not the prettiest, but uh, that'll work. We're looking over here, looking good. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw a little bit of cheese down there because I love cheese. Okay, and then we're going to put this uh, folded side down on there. We're going to let that uh, toast up a tiny bit. Look at that. Okay, move that to the side. Let's get another one going. I think I got enough. I'll throw a little more butter down. Griddle wasn't up to quite up to heat when I started that first one, which is okay. All right, get another uh, full size tortilla down. Get some cheese down. And, uh, you know, you can modify these however you want. And, uh, you know, you know I'm done, all right? <laughs> Before I do the uh, one you know I'm going to do, I'm going to throw some jalapenos on it. You can put peppers, you can put chicken, beef, whatever you want inside these. But these are just queso. I am spicing them up a little bit with the jalapenos. Let's get this folded up. It's too far along, like the other one. Okay, and the last fold. Okay, All right. <laughs> just like that piece of cake, right? Cheese to seal it. See how it looks? Look at there. Nice crispy cheese. We'll get a little more color on the back side and we'll do another one. Alright, we got enough oil and butter on here. We're going to do uh, one more and you know what's coming with this one, right? Got our cheese. Got our tahini. More cheese. And you guessed it. <laughs> I got
got to have my green chili, right? I'm going to load that with the green chili. Okay, just like that. Then you want to get the flip folding, I guess I should say, not flipping. Fold it in, fold it in, fold it in. Oh, that's hot. Fold it in. Okay. All right. My little cheese pile of what I've got left of my cheese. And lay it right on top. Seal it in there. Nice toasty brown. Jeez, almost there. Let's go a little bit longer and we'll be done. It's that easy. <laughs> yeah. All right, look at there. Crispy cheese. Sealed up nice, both sides. Let's go taste these. All right, there you go. Look at that. Queso crunchadillas. All right. Whew. A little chilly outside. There we go. Queso crunchadillas. I did one with uh, one with cheese, and I don't remember which is which. <laughs> I know the cheese one. Uh, I think this one's the one with the jalapeno, and this one is the one with the green chili. And I, I know I'm going to like that one, right? So let me just take a bite of the one with, I believe, is the uh, jalapenos. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I think this is the one with jalapenos. I didn't get one yet, but there's there's one in there. I see it. I think it's right there. Mm, mm hmm Okay, so everybody knows what a crunch wrap is, right? I mean, if you ever heard of Taco Bell, they have the crunch wrap Supremes and all that. They put meat and all this stuff inside of it. But a quesadilla is usually just cheese. Sometimes you can add other stuff like jalapenos, green chilies, chicken, beef, pork, whatever you want inside. I chose uh, originally to go with just the plain cheese, a case, quesadilla, and uh, that's where I got the name of queso crunchadilla because I did a just cheese, put the uh, crunch shell inside, and we sealed it up with some fried cheese. And uh, let me tell you, so far, this one with uh, the jalapenos is pretty darn good let me uh take a bite of just the one with just the cheese i didn't fold real well <laughs> so sorry about that so anyway let's do the just cheese mm -hmm. you can see that uh tahine tostada shell inside and i just used white cheese white uh melting cheese mexican melting cheese so tasty I mean, you could serve these for lunch. You can serve them. You can cut them up, serve them as an appetizer, or just give everybody one and let them munch. Mmm. Very cheesy. <laughs> All right. There we go. Queso crunchadilla. Get outside. Give them a try. Thanks for watching. And you know what? You know I hope you have an awesome day. Thank you.